Today we're going to be solving the hidden message from July 15th, 2016. If you watched that, it just flashed black and white. Some people thought this might be Morse code, which is a good guess, but if you control U to look at uh, the source code and we look for the keywords, which are the tags for the video, you can see I wrote barcode, and I even gave you a little hint of uh, frame one by one res. So some people uh, were able to figure this out without that guess. They figured it might be a barcode and they were right. If not, I pretty much told you right there. So let's go ahead and the first thing we're going to do is we are going to download that video. So I'm using YouTube DL to download that video. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to extract all the frames from it. So FFmpeg-i, the name of the video, and then we're going to output it as PNG files I'm going to label it IMG, and then this percent %3D just means it's going to put a three-digit number there. Uh, because if I didn't, it would go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And if you were to put those in alphabetical order, it would go 1, 10, 11, you know, so forth and so on. So I want it to be at least three digits. So if we run that out, it only takes a few seconds. We can now list out, and you can see that we have all our images starting with image 001, image 002, and if we look at the thumbnails for those, you can see they're all either fully black or fully white images. So if we were to pen them all together in a straight line, they would equal a barcode, but right now each image is 1080p, which is kind of big, and uh, so you'll get a really large number. In fact, if you're going to use image magic to create that image to append them all, it's going to tell you that it's too big. So we don't need it any bigger than one by one pixel, which was what my hint in the video was. So we could resize, resize. So what I'm going to do is here, I'm going to create a for loop, and I'm going to loop through every PNG in this folder, and I'm going to use convert, which is part of the image magic package, and I'm going to resize them all to one by one pixels, and then we're just going to overwrite the original file. So we do that. It'll take four or five seconds here. There we go. Now if we go back into our file manager here, here's the original video. You can barely see here, uh, they're now one pixel, so that's either going to be white, you're not going to see anything, or you might see a little dot like there and there. I'm not even that sure if it's going to pick up in this recording. But that's all we need. So now we're just going to use the image magic package again, and we're going to say convert plus append. If you did dash append, they would uh, append all the images uh, vertically, but we want them horizontally. And so we're going to say convert plus append every PNG, and I'm going to output it as a JPEG, uh, just so I can keep my individual frames and the final frame separate just by giving them different extensions. So I'll run that. Doesn't take very long because it's very, very small because each image, even though there's 347 of them, they're all one pixel each. Now if I was to display out that 100.jpg, you can barely see it here, but that is a barcode. I can stretch it out here a little bit and you can see it a little bit better, but uh, all we need is one pixel high. So it's one pixel high and I guess 347 wide. So now we can use uh, Z bar IMG, give it that file and it will give us the link to our hidden video. And if we go there, you can see the list of people who made it before I did this uh, this little example video, solution video. So go ahead and give props to each one of these guys who made it on their own. Just a shout out to them. And uh, yeah, so I really thought this one might be more difficult. Uh, but a lot of people made it, so we'll see what happens with the next one. The next one, uh, we'll see what happens. They're going to progressively probably get a little bit harder, and I might stop giving hints in some cases, but we'll see. I thank you for watching. Please visit my website, filmsbychris.com. That's Chris with the K. There should be a link in the description. And if you're enjoying these videos, let me know. Comment below, and uh, I hope you learned something here. So, have a great day.